In this video, we'll be going over how to use the Barbecue Guru app to control, modify, and monitor your cook with the Ultra Q controller. If you haven't downloaded the app and connected it to a Bluetooth enabled device yet, click here to watch our connecting to Bluetooth and Wi-Fi video on how to get set up and then come back. If you've already done that, let's get started. Once you're in the app, you can adjust the pit temperature you want to cook at. By default, it is set at 250 degrees. To change it, go to the app's main screen and tap the pit temperature. The target temperature is displayed underneath of the current temperature reading. Enter your desired pit temperature and be sure to press apply changes. The UltraQ can monitor up to three foods per cook. By default, their done temperatures are set at 185 degrees. To change them, click on each food's respective temperature from the home page. Like the pit temperature page, target temperature will always be displayed underneath of the current actual reading. Enter your desired temperature for each food and then tap apply changes to save the settings. When the smoker's lid is opened, the pit temperature drops, causing the fan to overfire the coals and cause cook overshoot when the lid is closed again. Open lid detection minimizes overshoot by limiting fan output while the smoker's lid is open. Open lid detection is on by default, but can be turned off in the controller settings. The UltraQ's SmartCook Adaptive Control Strategy is designed to continually learn what the pit is doing and adapt to many factors, including ambient temperature, amount of charcoal, and damper settings. The SmartCook feature allows you to tailor the adaptive algorithm to suit your specific pit with four preset options. Setting 1 is the default setting and the most often selected option. This setting is ideal for small, medium, and some large ceramic cookers, traditional kettles, and small cabinet smokers. Setting two is ideal for very efficient or insulated pits like the monolith. Setting three is ideal for uninsulated or offset pits that are less efficient than an average pit, such as a bullet smoker or common horizontal offset smokers. While the first three settings will cover 99% of cookers, setting four allows you to fine tune the algorithm and experiment with your unique setup. To select the smart cook feature that best matches your pit setup, select option one, two, three, or four from the controller settings in the menu. To learn more about deviation settings and ramp mode, take a look at the manual, which is accessible from the app. The UltraQ has a built-in countdown timer with three different options for when it reaches zero. No action, hold pit temperature, and alarm. For those with someone else's controller with an earshot, you can customize your alarm sound to tell the difference between your cook and your neighbors. Both visual and audio alarms can be turned off in the app. You can customize your individual UltraQ controller from the controller settings menu. You can rename your controller, turn off the display screen LEDs, turn off audible alarms, modify your alarm sound, or invoke scan mode. For anything else, the UltraQ user manual is available in the Barbecue Guru application menu.